Jumbo, bonjour, what's up guys? Welcome to Black Umoja. It's a boy Heart Flow here again. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you're a subscriber, you already know what it is. And if it's the first time here, welcome home. We all about unveiling all the hidden talent around the world, entertain, educate, and inspire. If there's not a sign that interests you, please consider subscribing, you know? We don't like strangers here. Today's video is a little bit different. It's not a performance video, it's not a poetry, just a little series I've been doing, like a little sort of motivation talking. If you've been watching Black Emoja, you already know I've done one on uh, mentoring, and the second one was on why I believe that hard work beats talent. And this third one is about consistency. Why do we need to be consistent in order to be successful? You know, consistency is the key. That's the third one. Just before we dive in, I'd like to clarify a little bit. I'm not a profession. I'm not a qualified advisor or anyway, but I'm speaking from my own experience. So I hope that my experience can inspire some people and a little one or two advice you can pick from this episode will be helpful in your life or in your journey as a creator or a creative mind. So yeah, let's dive in. We've heard a lot for talking about consistency. Why do you need to be consistent? You know, I've been getting a lot of questions for me saying, oh, Hard, you know, you told us that you need a mentor. Uh, now I've got a coach. I've been working hard for years, but I'm not seeing any progress. I'm not seeing any results. You know, hold a second, you know. In order for you to see results, you need to be consistent, you know. I'll give a little example, you know. Think of when we eat food. Do we just eat food once? and hope for a result to not, never be hungry for the next two weeks, or do we eat consistently so we don't get hungry all the time? The same as anything in life, really. You go to the gym to lose weight, you need to do it more and more and more. You gotta be consistent. You wanna be successful in whatever field you are in, you gotta be consistent. You wanna be an artist, the same things apply. So. I'm just saying that we need to be consistent. Those people who have been asking me if you've got a coach already, you've been working hard, why are you not seeing results? Perhaps, maybe you are, you're not consistent in whatever you are doing. Let's say you've been working hard for two, three years in whatever you are doing. You know, you are not consistent, but you're working hard. You, you, are, you are putting time, but you're just not consistent. Trust me, you're not gonna see results. Why? Because you gotta do something every day. You gotta do it like, on a sort of a, Schedule best, like if you say you want to do weekly, or you got to do weekly, weekly until you see result. But the day you stop doing that weekly, the day you stop being consistent, if you are going, let's say there's a ladder, you are climbing one, two, three, four, five, and you skip one week. If you're on the fifth ladder, you go back on the third one. So you lose two steps, same as in life. So you got to be consistent whatever you're doing, you know. It doesn't matter how, how hard you work, if you're not consistent, you can't see results. I'm guilty of this. Sometimes when I have a lot of things to do, I can sit at home, like smash all the things like all day from eight to midnight, kill myself, you know? Trying to do, trying to, trying to smash the project so I can fix the project on time. But then I finish it, later on I check, oh my God. Imagine if I did this, like if, if I had a whole week to do the complete the whole project, if I did Monday, one hour, Tuesday, another hour, Wednesday until Sunday, the project will be done, and that will be stressing. It's the same as anything in life. We can't smash all the things at once. Some people, I know a lot of artists who are super talented. They've got mentors, they are working hard, but they are not consistent. That's the biggest, like the biggest factor. They are not consistent. Like they drop a song six months ago, and then they disappear in the community. And then after another eight months, they come back with another banger. Of course, yes, you're gonna get some fame, but Imagine if you're consistent. You can see the result that you can achieve. Like, trust me, consistency is the key. Check on your, your favorite artists, your favorite uh, people you watch, you look up to, your motivators. Check them out. Like, watch your routine. They are so consistent with whatever they are doing. They don't sleep. Like, they are working hard. Actually, I would rather give uh, 50% every day for the next five weeks than giving 200% once and then sit at home for three weeks and then come back in at 200%. That's not how it works in life, you know? The first key is you gotta find a mentor, get a coach. The second key is to work hard. The third one is being consistent. If you are a student, if you are a creative mind in whatever field you are doing, 
you gotta be consistent. I don't want to talk too much in this episode. I just want to share this little tip with everybody. I know maybe one or two people will pick something out of this. But guys, I beg you guys to be consistent. Doesn't matter how hard you work, but if you're not consistent, you're not going to see the result. I am so guilty of this. I am working on this myself. And I would like you guys to join me in this journey, you know? I'm, I'm, I'm striving myself. Like, I know I'm so busy. I got a lot of work to do, but I'm fighting every day to drop two videos a week on this channel, Black Omoja. I still have my own life outside this. I got my work, I got my business. But, you know, I believe in consistency. If you're consistent, you're going to see the result. And most people you guys are watching, I'm pretty sure you can see how our little channel is growing so quick. And all oh, thanks to you guys. Thank you, thank you so much, you know. I really appreciate you guys for continuing supporting your channel. Without you guys, we can't do this. So, thank you. Uh, just a little detail, I've been talking about the giveaway. So, if you haven't checked out Instagram, Go check our Instagram post for more infos on how to enter the giveaways. And yeah, if you want to win, I just want to give back to my amazing subscribers, my amazing community. You guys are there. Rio G, thank you. Thank you so much. May God bless you. And yeah, take it easy. That was nice.